All right, now let's move over to London for the grand premiere of the movie Second Wife. Enjoy it. Here you interrupt me when I am talking. Igbato shikere awa la faro pata enjosi. Moniko kune kone kama binu. Kilote, your husband has money. The much-anticipated movie Second Wife had a successful London premiere with Nigerian movie stars based in the United Kingdom coming out for an evening of glitz and glamour. It is not using our tradition to come and take your home. Second Wife movie premiere is all about cultural promotion. Guests come out in beautiful traditional outfit and really show off their various styles on the red carpet. <laughs> Well, everything came out good. The general production was good. The effects was are good. I think everyone put in their best in this movie and it's a movie to watch. that a lot of women would love to have in the home you know to protect other women from being abused you know by the men you know because in second wife obviously my brother decided because his um his first wife couldn't give him a child that he needed another woman and that created a lot of problems heartache you know so my role there was to see how i can stop it but unfortunately i couldn't <laughs> but at least i tried Nigerians as well as other nationals from the Odeon Theatre to watch the much talked about movie by director Nelson Spike. This woman is not staying in this house. The very day a man decides to marry the second wife, this is what he gets. What have I done that no one has done before? The movie is called Second Wife, a Yawo Keji, that's in Yoruba. It looks at how a man can have two wives here in the UK. Why is it unique? Because in the UK, it is illegal to have a second wife. Now, in Nigeria, it is strange. What is illegal about that? But in the UK, it has its own specific things that we can play around with. So it's funny, as well as it also teaches that there are two sides to a story.
having a second wife in the UK, in London, because it's obviously something that's, it happens in Nigerian culture and African culture, so how would it happen and how would it play out if it happened in London, for instance? And that's kind of the idea that we took and how we ran with the whole story. There's a big difference, mainly because you have to kind of look at the cultural influences that you have in the UK that you don't necessarily have in Nigeria and the stereotypes and the stigmas over here and over here um, over in Nigeria are very different so what is accepted here is not necessarily accepted there and vice versa so that's something you kind of have to think about but all in all a Nigerian will always be a Nigerian wherever you take them so that is something that we kind of looked at as well. It's like it's like in Nigeria I've been in Nigeria I know we are used to second wife thing in Nigeria so it's, it's just like being in Nigeria as well I don't there was no problem being the mother of the second wife because you know as much as I was pushing her please don't use me as a scapegoat I've said to you if you want to marry Tia go ahead and marry her The cast and crew are indeed excited at the turnout of event, but most importantly proving that Nollywood film production in diaspora has come to stay. The, the idea behind it is the same, is to tell a story, tell a very good African or Nigerian story and put it into audiovisual for people to embrace and enjoy. And the best storytellers anywhere in the world, I believe personally, and I'm biased, are Africans and most especially Nigerians. So in the UK, we're able to tell the stories because Nigerians live in the UK. Back home in Nigeria, the stories are also told because they own the stories. I don't think there's much difference. Um, I don't think there should be any competition or comparison. I think there should be a complementing. That is my personal opinion. I play the role of the chief who is encouraging my nephew to make sure that he gets as many wives as possible. This is about second wife. I'm the one who actually encouraged me to take the second wife because for unknown reason, as part of our tradition and culture, hey, polygamous is one of those things that happens. Don't tell me why. <laughs> it's just a reality of life. Second Wife is a suspense field and intriguing comedy drama set in London, showcasing the beauty and diversity of African culture. We want to bring our culture to show, showcase it to the white man's country for them to see and see how our culture, what we do, because there's a lot of intermarriages going on in the United Kingdom. And for those people who are foreigner, it's good for them to see our culture. So t tonight you can see there's a lot of people from different race, from different background, from different culture, trying to embrace our culture. I think it's going further because it's really a nice dramatic movie that people are looking forward to watch. So I'm sure it's going to go far. The movie is expected to premiere in Nigeria soon. Your husband has money. Spend it. I cannot live with this woman. I'm not interested in who's wrong and who is right here. And that is the reason why you have to go look for her. What have I done that no one has done before?